Hey everybody, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Rebirth, here to Narwhal, and today, I think you should go watch the previous video, if you haven't. If you uh, don't want any spoilers, don't watch that video, but as you can see by the, uh, I mean, why would you be watching this late in the series if you don't want spoilers, but anyway, oh, I guess, never mind, this is a uh, separate series, I'm kind of an idiot, um, so, if you notice, this isn't part of the main Isaac series. Uh, we're going to be doing some challenge runs tonight, and hopefully we can uh, knock some out of the way. Last stream, I ended up finishing Waka Waka, which unlocked a, uh, a sweet new item. And if once again, if you haven't seen the last episode, you need to. So, Su Suicide King, uh, we unlocked the Family Man last time. And I want to try that out because it looks like you had a whole bunch of familiars. I think that's a lot of fun. Yeah, we can't shoot, but we have uh, Brother Bobby, Sister Maggie, and Infested Baby. We also have Dad's Key, so we're basically just Dad. What else do we have? Oh, BFF! Our, friend, our flies and stuff are big. Not our flies. Our um, familiars are better. Um, since you only have to beat... You open oh you can open locked rooms that makes dad's key way better yeah since you can um beat the game on challenge runs just by beating mom i feel like we have a pretty good chance of winning now our tier rate is really low but i think our damage is pretty good mainly because um we have bff of course Wow. Okay. Now, uh, remember in challenge runs, we don't actually get a an item room on every floor. Okay, I feel like I'm just going to be using Rotten or Infested Baby most of the time. Maybe Rotten Baby, I don't know. For some reason, I can never remember the name of it, even though it's one of my favorites, and I say that all the time. God. Fly, go get him. Yeah. We can kill stuff through rocks with him, which is why I use him. Kind of wish I had a bomb. I'm pretty sure that would give us a seeker room. We're fighting Pin. Now, most of our damage is going to be accidental, I assume, on this guy, because it's really hard to aim when you fire only with uh, your familiars, but it's weird aiming this way. I do feel kind of strong, actually, but like when we hit, we deal a lot of damage. There we go. Alright, that's actually not worth taking, I think. Because, like, we don't... Will our babies actually be affected? I don't think that actually affected our babies. Alright, well, on to the next floor. Unfortunately, we're not going to be able to get into... the range where we can buy any of those items. Because one of the items was, um, oh, that's so nice. One of the items was the, like, blue fly, which gives you bigger flies, which, with Infested Baby, it's pretty darn good. I don't feel like we need keys. <laughs> like, we don't need keys very much because we've got Dad's key. Like, we can just do this. Every, like, two rooms, it looks like. What would actually help us on this on this run? More familiars? Alright. Place... Yeah. More rotten baby, the better. If we could get, like, um... Sissy long legs? That'd be pretty good.
Paralysis, okay. It's an interesting run. But, um... I'm going to try to do a consistent series of challenge runs, because I know I need to get them to uh, fully complete the game, technically, so I want to do that. Especially because of what happened in the, the previous run. I'm not going to talk about the previous run until next episode of the challenge run series. Hopefully. Yeah, it was in... <laughs> we actually had a baby inside of the boss, and he was helping us out there. The Book of Belial is worthless for us, I believe, because our... Actually, our damage does affect our flies. However, I don't think it's worth picking up Book of Belial, so we're just going to keep going. I wonder if it's made that way specifically to make... um those rooms worthless because it is seated I think if it's not seated then oh, well curse of the lost sucks yeah Get infested baby on the case I always forget if it's rotten or infested baby I apologize if I'm saying the wrong one consistently There we go. I was hoping to get out of that room without getting hit, that's why I used Dad's key. Whatever. But we're close. We can taste the money. Ow. Two of hearts. Judgment. Human judgment. Two of hearts, that's amazing. Get it down until the max. Oh, never mind. Okay. Sin up. Actually gave us too many black hearts on accident. Empress gives us. Whore of Babylon State for one room. I don't think Whipworm, not Whipworm, Hookworm would actually affect us at all. Look kind of cool. Like a, uh, King of Hearts 2 Riku kind of character. If only we had Eden's, like, long hair model, we would look exactly like him. I don't really think the blue map's worth it either. So we're just gonna keep going. Now that I know we can use two bombs to get a bunch of bombs, I'll buy this just in case we get another. We need a bigger bomb to do that. And the Mr. Mega bug does not happen in this. I believe. Pete. Yeah, we have a little trouble with bosses, but that's fine. Really, on Mom, I'm just gonna focus on dodging and hope our flies continuously hit. Why did I take the Devil? That has no effect on us at all. Oh wait, yes it does. Flies. Because we may not deal damage with our... Like, we may not have tears to deal damage with, but our... Wow, okay, so Gimp. Now, now it makes even more sense that we can't use uh, Tears or anything like that. Now when we get hurt, we have a chance of spawning a... A Soul Heart for ourselves? Let's just keep moving. If we can end up beating this like pretty quickly, we might have a chance of actually doing a another challenge run on the first episode. That'd be very nice. Of course, we're not gaining any damage or momentum, so... Like, really, we're just really tanky. So, I'd like to get some stuff that would help us out. 
Because I don't want this run to take like 11 years on the later floors. Oh my. Well, I guess it didn't matter. Gimpy paid out as well. That's the thing that I'm talking about. Like, we are, <laughs> we're tanky. Like, a lot of the time when we get hurt, it's not going to matter. Alright, so our flies don't one-shot these guys. So, it's the beginning of the end for our uh, pretty good damage with the flies. It's decent, it's just not as good as it was on the last floor. Doesn't feel like it, at least. Book of Revelations, Satanic Bible. I've never had Satanic Bible. I actually unlocked it on the last run, so it's kind of sad that I, I won't be able to use it to its full effect, because I actually kind of, I'm liking Dad's Key. Free access to like any room. One might argue that I have enough keys now to unlock almost every room on my way. Might be right. But um, let's try to roleplay the Dad role as much as possible and try to keep our key. Be responsible. How are we supposed to get in the house if we don't have a key? By the ladder. Dads have ladders, right? My dad owns a ladder. Now this one does. Pretty sweet. Alright, you. Wow. Isn't this an exciting room? What's Chad? He looks so surprised to see us. Alright, let's keep doing that. That did a lot of damage to Chad. I don't think Chad is quite as tanky as he was in the last game, but he's still kind of annoying. Because, once again, the lower his health is, the faster he is, so... There we go. Sure, little Chad. Gives us kisses. We actually have a giant Chad. Look at him. He's so happy. I guess you can play this seed even if you're not doing the challenge run? So if you want, F9TLC0KS. I'll try to remember to do that in case we have some cool runs, uh, even if it is a challenge run. I don't know how that works. Like, is the challenge run seeded? Or... What? I don't know. Alright. Guppy's paw. If we became Guppy, I would be so disappointed because we couldn't do anything with it. All we would gain is flying. Which is good. But we have the ladder? I don't know. Okay, this is the wrong way, unfortunately. So we just uh, forced ourselves to fight another room. Never mind. Now we just have to fight this one again. Oh, now we can just stand in here. We'll get him fly. Yeah. Another Teratoma room, huh? It's not the hardest room in the world. It's just more difficult because we can't actually aim very well. And our tears come out super slow. It's basically like playing a game at like negative latency. I guess negative latency would be like good. That's how that works. Latency would be like. Isn't that how latency works? Like the lower the number, the um, better? So, like, negative would be, like, it's happening before you even input the command, so it's, like, a mind-reading program. Or, I guess you could have assumed that I meant negative as in a, uh, like, negative... Like, how I feel about it. Pretty negative. I'm gonna try to dad's key through as many rooms as possible. <laughs> Oh my god. We're dying. Ugh. Yeah. The adversary? This hardly seems fair. <laughs> it's 
circle. Really, jump right at the, the right time, adversary. Why not? There we go. We got toothpicks. Krampus. Oh, Krampus's head could actually win us the run by itself. Don't lose hope yet. We actually don't have that many floors left, so if we got Krampus's head, things could start looking up for us. Unfortunately, we wouldn't be able to skip rooms anymore, but we would actually be able to kill rooms, so... Oh, man. Lump of coal hurts so bad. I don't even know if it affects... It does not appear that it affects our bonus baby tears. Two more floors of this. Uh, I don't... I don't know how I feel about that. Right. Ugh. What's that in the middle? What is that? Why were you shielded? <laughs> Alright, let's go this way. Oh my god. Wall master room. Oh, there were two of you. Three of you, in fact. Wow. Going downhill fast. We did not get good items for this. Once again, let's try the passive strategy. Where we just, like, get somewhere safe, and then let flies do the job. Really? Run? Bye. I know the secret room was there. I didn't want to, um... I didn't want to close the boss door. Okay. Well, this eternal heart's gonna help us out a little bit. Just trying to spawn flies and kill everything. I don't know how to fight this boss, really, like this. Are you gonna... Are you gonna stomp? Are you just gonna... Do I have to shoot the sides? Oh my god. That's so obnoxious. Oh, he did damage there. Things are looking up. Yeah, take that, mom's ankle. Oh, Gimpy. You're the best. It's a very slow fight. Wow, okay. Stomp, please. Not on me. I, uh... That was a little... little fast. A little faster than expected. Placenta actually just healed us. We did it! Is that the boss, ru boss rush room? Also, I thought you only had to beat Mom's heart. I thought you only had to beat Mom to complete challenges.
We're not strong enough for that. As much as I want cancer on this run, I can't afford it. So, do we have to beat the womb now? I thought we'll... Did we, didn't we only beat mom last time? I don't know. Alright, this room's not so bad. Probably to the right up here. I had to guess. Oh my god, this is so sad. Oh man. Oh, are we actually going the right way somehow? It's a very long path if it's not right. You might die. But if nothing else, remember how hard I tried on that run. Yep. Okay, well let's try another challenge really quickly. Cat got your tongue. What is this? We're guppy. Oh my god, do we only get... Guppy's hairball and... Guppy's head? We have a lot of health. But we can't destroy poop. Okay. There we go. Looks like that's the case. Wow. Okay, let's keep going then. Tuka flies. Is this an XL floor? Oh my god. Just die. Thank you. This is an XL floor. Also, uh, there's the seed if you want it. I'm not going to put these in the description since they don't really matter to the challenge, but if you are interested in playing the run itself, XH3CXBVS. Beat and range up. That's actually kind of nice. Wish Guppy's head was floatier. Go. What happened to our face? Oh man. I don't think mom's knife actually affects anything. I actually don't think brimstone does either because we can't shoot, so why would it matter? Let's just keep going before we lose all of our health. See, this is one where you only have to go to mom. Why did I have to go to the womb on that one? Probably specifically in the challenge. Quickest way to mom's heart is through dad. I guess it's... Yeah, why am I... Why do I have that face? Oh, we picked up that syringe. Okay. I'm an idiot. Also, I'm taking a lot of damage because Guppy's hairball is really hard to hit things with. Go get him, boys. There we go. Alright. Please. Oh! Angel room. All stats. Plus puberty and explosive diarrhea. Nice.
Oh man, that guppy's hairball action with speed up is actually pretty good. The hollow! Right, you can fly. Sorry, I forgot about that. Oh hey, when we hit with a hairball, we actually generate flies as well. That's kind of nice. Speed plus shot speed. Wow, we can really generate some gyration on this, uh... On that. We're not gonna blow that up. But just keep moving. Keep our forward momentum. We're almost out of the soul hearts it gave us at the beginning. Which sucks a little bit. But not a huge deal. Okay. Got these hairballs big again. Yeah. At least we can lay bombs. And having flying is pretty nice as well. Don't want to overlook that. Okay. You. We're so fast. Okay. Okay. Death. That's nice. I know that room's kind of easy. That's okay, though. Yep. Eyes, please. Eyes. At least we summon flies when we hit them with our hairball. That's our one saving grace. Tears down. Doesn't matter at all. Thank you. Wow. Okay. This room sucks. Really bad. Oh, hey! Gubby's hairball blocks tears. Good to know. This room just got a little bit easier. Wow. Okay. All right, we can fly. I was trying to go in between the aisles there. Anything in the shop that can help me? Um, someone say greed? Okay. Really doesn't want me to have another space bar besides Gubby's head, it looks like. Please. Oh my god. That's not what I was hoping for. Okay. Thank you for the heart. Oh my god. Oh no. Don't do it to me. Not like this. Whew. Looks like there's red hearts on the floor in one of these. Gotta be careful though. That's one hit. Good luck. This is Catacombs Part 2. We have two floors after this? Oh, the Fallen. Okay. Okay. Fallen, if you could. Maybe cut that out. Oh, no. Well, uh, that's our first challenge run episode. Hopefully that's not the theme of how we do. Uh, we have a lot to do. We have 20. Oh, we still have one locked. 
Hopefully we can unlock that in the main series at some point, but we, uh, we already had one down at the start of the first episode, so technically we're still one for one, right? Wink? Alright, well, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys look forward to more challenge runs in the future. We're gonna try it, and I hope we beat them pretty frequently. So, once again, th thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button. It really helps out a lot. If you want to see more in the future, please join us again tomorrow for another episode of Binding of Isaac Rebirth Challenge Runs. I'll see you next time.